if you are new to my channel lovely viewer welcome my goal this year for this channel is to document all the plants that I have in the garden and um, especially the roses so this is now the number 12 rose I'm going to present to you that's how it looks like from the bottom to the top it has these beautiful flowers now it's a bundle of flowers here the bees are feasting on these flowers so the name of this rose is blue for you and another name that is known for this rose is Pechum Blue Pechum Blue now this rose was bred by James Peter in 2006 and was introduced in the market 2007 in the UK by Warner Roses. Now this rose got an award from RHS uh, Garden Merit Award uh, 2012 and for those of you who doesn't know RHS, it's in the UK. It means uh, Royal Horticultural Society. Now this rose is uh, a repeat uh, flowering uh, shrub rose, which actually growing to a height of um, now is about I think it's about 110 and can actually spread to 80 centimeters now I've got um, roses here which I have introduced to you um, these two roses here the Rhapsody in blue and the for your eyes only which is now trying to catch our attention guys look at the color of that but anyway we stick to this beautiful rose too now this has um, a very healthy very healthy character and it blooms in clusters and let's see now this is a new one here it's trying to open the bloom it starts the bloom is a semi double petal and it starts to open now you can see it has a color of uh, violet and blue and also this um, mauve uh, color and when you see if it's uh, totally open now the bloom you can see that it slowly changes from the uh, this blue violet color to um, mauve uh, mauve blue color and it has a um, golden stamen in the middle and a white color also in the middle so it really looks so attractive for us for for people and for the insect so now let's go back to this blue violet color of the uh, rose from here it changes to this color if you can see it it is a slightly bluish uh, a tinge of um, color there and from that it will change to this now these are all slowly at the end of its bloom slowly fading and it changed to this uh, gray uh, mauve color so a fantastic play of color and it matches you with my allium, which is also fading slowly. Beautiful. This is a nice picture here with the almost the same color with the allium. This one and this 
lovely and we have the white onions there I almost forgot that this rose has a very strong scent of what we call in German uh, Feilchen and Feilchen in English is Pansy or Violets so it has this strong scent of Violets or Pansy so as you can see these three um, wonderful roses here you have now a known uh, blue for you and the other one on the left side is Rhapsody in blue and this uh, for your eyes only now these three roses I got it I think seven years ago and I planted them actually several places in my garden so I always transfer it and I think I transferred it four times so these roses are for me uh, have gone a lot of stress but as you can see they are quite happy now in this place they all the three of them all love a sunny place but they are producing a lot of blooms in on this spot and I'm so happy to have them in my garden 